darkness. The room is silent. Is there anywhere hidden? Out of mind, there's no one. And within this intuitive contrast, a coincidental reminder, the light has penetrated its disappointment. Its disappointment, although diminished, refuses to clarify. And from opaque to gray an aspect of inconsequentiality, anonymous ghost beholden to shadow, falling between shafts of mist upon the window sill. And the incense and incandescence, a house made of wind, an ash of neutrality, threads of inspiration bound to a conditional presence. Complete with muted complications, a radiant witness, a clock stop. Transcendent nuance, as if someone has entered, attempting to make known its being, there's no silence equaled. To the senses of the moment, meanwhile, in the meantime, a breath of anticipation awaits the participation of the welcoming, of where no one else hides, of where nowhere else remains hidden.